Hi friends, this is Nageshwar. Welcome to my channel ITBot143. In this tutorial, I will show how to write down a program to interchange or swapping of two numbers. In this tutorial, I am assuming two numbers x equal to 24 and y equal to 31. And I want to swap these numbers as x equal to 31 and y equal to 24. Now, for doing this, I want to create a program in Turbo C++. First, I want to use printf command for showing a message to user in terminal. Enter two numbers. And after that, I will use scanf for user defined input values percentage t and percentage t. And before this, we need to define two variables integer x comma y and play a screen. And after that, come to scanf and address of x comma address of y. Now, to interchange or uh, swapping of two numbers, here first I will create one variable called z, and by using this z value, I will swap both numbers so for that z equal to x so first I will bring x value into z and after that x equal to y and after that I will bring y value into the x and after that y equal to z then i will bring the value stored in z into the y after that now i will use printf slash n x percentage d and y percentage t now both x comma y values and after that get ch return 0 and close this so it is very easy to interchange or swapping of two numbers by using a third variable so in this tutorial i have created a third variable as z so first i will move x value into this z then i will bring y value into the x and after that i will bring the value stored in z into the y so with this i can successfully interchange the two numbers now before running this let's compile this program Here it is showing 0, 1x and 0 errors. Okay. And save this file. Now run this program. It is asking enter two numbers. Here I have entered x equal to 24 and y equal to 31. Sorry, your catch okay. Alt here. Now run this program.
24 and 31 and here we have successfully interchanged the two numbers now i got x equal to 31 and y equal to 24 okay so like this we can write a program to interchange or swapping of two numbers by using a third variable i hope this video will help in your practice if you like this video please click on like button and please share this video with your friends and please visit my channel it about 143 to watch more latest updated videos and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you friends have a nice day